Generic greetings and welcome back once again to my recycling centre. Today's beverage is a very refreshing chilled lemon and lime drink. So welcome back to the game and in the previous video we were doing some re recycling because that's what the game is about. And in this video more of the same but with a bit of an added change here we uh, have a couple of these to clean and also we've got enough money and approval whatever you want to call that basically we we can buy a new type of thing to recycle and i'm hoping it's going to be something with a very big machine so we'll just clean this up first we'll probably do the car that's currently waiting because they've been there quite a while and i feel a little bit guilty and we're going to uh yeah, we're going to do some recycling there and then we'll see what we can buy. So just finishing off this one here. Um, there we go, nice and clean. Okay, so let's open the gate. And there's been some new stuff added since I last played this. We have things like new cars and I think some uh, new uh, disposables, things like... I don't know if this is new, The it says it's a faucet. It's like for pouring beer or cider or whatever other beverages are available. Um, this can go in the waste paper. So that was quite an easy one. So there we go. And let's go over to the shop and management here. And mainly in management, we've got 176 approval. And you know what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to go with scrap tyres. Because looking at all of this, one of the biggest machines in the game is a two-shaft shredder. A shredder with a rotor blades and conveyor belt for uh, for scrapping tires so we're gonna go with scrap tires and yes and then i will purchase from here this thing and then that's gonna to have to go probably here and the shredder and it is in where is it scrap tires and accept and let's see what it is like whoa okay that is pretty good so the tires go in here it slowly goes up into there gets minced in and then goes to there excellent right let's go ahead and see if um i can already see something sticking out the side of the green van there um i think that was a guitar stem or something like that stem what's the end of it a guitar um anyway cardboard boxes that can go in there that is waste paper this bin here this plastic barrel i don't know if that's new but uh, that goes in there this is a garbage bag it might be recyclables uh no it is well residential waste we've got a chair here that sadly goes into t into that i don't really like that but uh nice to sell that we've got oh yeah, this is gonna make us actually quite a bit of money because we've got all of these bags that can go in here yeah that's fine so those are all chargeable it's six generic units of currency each which is what we want gonna pick up these recyclable bags and pop it in there and then we've got this cooler which i'm fairly confident is bulk trash and i was going to check out what this electric guitar was but i can already see one in the back there so unless i've put that in incorrectly that should be fine so we're going to charge the customer 24 generic currency and then we'll check out and there we go more satisfaction earned i don't know how big a machine you can actually get in the game thus far so we've got things like this two shaft shredder compact container closed container device testing we've got a document shredder this is the one i want next which is a garden waste chopper there's also this drum compactor which you can do bulk trash timber or waste paper i would like to get that and replace the uh the standard bulk trash one but we'll see how we go oh we've got a tire so we, the first time we're going to use our new machine we've also got appears to be a cooker there as well um the, the i think the game does still have that thing where the car stops and it turns a little bit but it's uh not as prevalent as before now this should be household appliances yes indeed and then we've got the tire so here we go and we put it on there and how do we activate it? Is there a button here? Yes, there is. So engage the shredder and, oh, it goes up there. Yep, and into the shredder and, hey, look at that. Excellent. So this, we can turn that off. Good, that's, uh, that's all good. Right, uh, is there any fees for that? Yes, so tires, I should have checked before, tires are a fee of 10 generic units of currency. Okay, this is good. I wonder if, I mean, in real life, obviously, shredding these ones, you're literally separating out the rubber and the, like, the reinforcement and the metal. I guess you'll be straining that out and sifting it out or whatever. Um, just jumping up and down here just to see what's on the back there. What happens is the game spawns in a vehicle, then it slowly starts populating it. Uh, we can't really see from up here, and I definitely wouldn't recommend you do uh, what I've just done there, which is jumping up and down on... Uh, 
on these open topped bins the containers so we're just going to do a bit of a clean here you don't need to be too you don't need to like power wash simulator levels of um precision on this one because it does have a very good sort of leeway grace period type of thing so just get all of this cleaned and there we go that's fine and there we go something like that and we'll open the gate again what we're seeing on the back there eh, it looks to be what is that what sort of is that piece of furniture um well we've got this table here which i'm gonna check but i think it's timber yeah so that goes in there and please don't say this gets shredded it's a couch bulk trash i mean well any charity shop or even i would go i would say any charity shop would take that oh no sorry it doesn't have a fire tag so no uh they probably wouldn't however any antiques place will probably want this but uh even just auction but uh no apparently we're just getting rid anyway scrap metal we'll get rid of that uh plastic box that can go in the back there we've got a uh, plastic container which i'm fairly sure goes in recyclables that's a clock which is scrap metal and again i mean it might not function but uh, is this scrap metal it is uh i mean garbage bag that can go in there at least they're not fly tipping it is all i can say anyway customer fees bit of six and there we go again uh 83 thumbs up and 1105 generic units of currency i think i said the next one i want to go for is going to be this uh, industrial shredder here and uh, we can act out scenes from fargo and yeah what we're going to go next with oh a big big vehicle there which is good <laughs> noticing you can jump up and um i think it says you can press delete to uh to deny uh the next load i don't think we uh, are going to do that yeah in terms of the next unlock i'm fairly confident we're gonna go with garden waste yeah garden waste not enough satisfaction for this transaction okay let's get this opened up and they've nearly sheared off the barrier there <laughs> so a big sort of box van with a, with a roll shutter at the back and um the fling stuff out already okay so this is going to be scrap metal this ladder almost certainly i'm not even going to test it and then we've got deck chair now that could be bulk or it could be uh scrap it's bulk in this particular case there is a cabinet that again that's probably going to be timber but i'm going to double check and that bed frame almost certainly is scrap metal surely yeah that's fine i mean obviously we have done uh, oh yes, load of tyres, and I just double check. Yeah, charge customer. I, I, I just want to see if tyres are a bit different, um, but not. Oh, they're all they're all made the same. Yeah, I mean there has been um, has been obviously bits we've recycled before, um, but it's difficult to remember all of them. Like that long case clock, I would have thought that could have gone in. Well, that could have gone in someone's house, truth be told. But um, yeah, apparently it goes in the bulk. This is a is that a couch? yeah that can go in here i think it's getting pretty full and we're just going to keep going on with the shredding here let's see what it looks like from this point don't try this at home obviously and yeah it breaks in a bit and down it goes excellent okay so we are going to uh charge the customer some fees and send them send them on their merry way do i want to empty this bulk trash i don't think i need to at this stage um oh yeah we've got uh, we've got like these compactors now get full as well which is uh, pretty good so we've got bulk trash and cell container remove and store empty and there we go we'll just empty it uh, we don't need to do that but uh does it cost money i'm not sure anyway it's done now and good grief that that was listing like a ship so we've got what appears to be I mean, it is a van. It's a, it's a van. I was going to say it's a people carrier, but uh, no, not so much. And um, we've got a park bench, which is going to be timber. Yes, so we're going to put that in there. I'm going to, I think, activate as well the, the crusher and maybe deactivate that. I don't think there's any running costs involved, but we'll uh, remove that. Ah, now this, I believe, deny disposal. Yes, we're not allowed. Or rather, we're not going to uh, recycle that. So we'll put this one back on, like so. And shredders now. Hang on. Engage shredder F. Will not activate. Shredder will not activate. Um, there we go. It's working now. And what I'll do is I will 
charge the fees and send that back. There you go. So exhaust, deny disposal, so not sorted. Uh, yeah. And not, yeah, just not sorted. It's got rid of, so that's fine. That's exactly what we want. And we'll turn off the shredder. Is all of the... Oh, yeah, look at that. All the bits of tyres are piling up. I wonder what percentage of that hopper is full. Um... Two shaft shredder, scrap tyres. Doesn't have a percentage. Hmm, how curious. Run 94 satisfactory on. The next one's going to be garden waste. That will then unlock the chopper. And there's also other waste types as well, like uh, there's hazardous waste. And on previous comments, people were saying like how somehow cathartic and satisfying the game is. And it really is. It really is. Oh, uh, on case clock book trash um, and how would this, these simulators these niche ones that it seems to be the 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 more niche more niche more better basically um, and yeah oh whoops uh, well that was technically sorted so there you go uh, armchair is gonna go in there most likely this is a couch that's going to go in there. Now, that, that's definitely in need of recycling. I don't think we can really save that. Cabinet is timber. And we've got this fridge, which is going to go in household appliances. And those ones can actually break apart quite well, that one. Um, we've got a deck chair, which is bulk trash. And by the way, you can actually pick this stuff up individually and um, dump them in like this. And we're probably going to have to. Uh, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll get rid of this tyre. Uh, tie can go on there and activate. That's going now. And that's getting crushed. Gone, gone, and gone. And then we will uh, charge a customer and again send them on their way. 103 generic units of currency, uh, just under uh, what we need. Well, not just actually, but we're definitely under what we need, but getting closer to the, the next one there. Let's have a quick look at the shop and management we do have this container uh compactor we have these two types of container or do we have this one actually um we got this one i think this one and this one the spb and the apb we've got a skip medium we've got some of these uh, large bulk ones we haven't got to skip the side doors hasn't got the ha hazardous waste container um that drum compactor is pretty good <laughs> anyway next one and oh spin in the front tires there I'm seeing some cardboard boxes. Is this going to be one where it catapults the stuff out the back as soon as it stops and the and the boot opens? Uh, apparently not. This is a cardboard box for a gaming system. Yes, that is a gaming system indeed. And uh, I believe it was a 600 gig gaming system. Yes, it is. Excellent. Right, that can go on waste paper. Um, we've got a pizza box. Oh, no. That says, yeah... Drop in residential waste. I was going to say, it's contaminated paper. Um, so we can't recycle that. Uh, yeah, you may have noticed, actually. I did mess one up and there's a there's a garbage bag there that shouldn't have been in recyclables. But it is what it is. I'm not going to worry about it too much. More satisfaction is earned and off they go. We do have loads of space for expansion. Obviously, if you were so inclined, you could get multiple of these bins here and have them all going all the way to the back. Um, we don't need to do that. We, we can quickly just go over and empty them if need be. Uh, for the scrap tyres, um, what else can we put on? We've got we've got uh, metal stairs, if we were to be, to be so inclined, an automatic photo sensor. Uh, oh, well, so will that automatically start it? That might be pretty good, actually. The question is, though, how much is the... Waste chopper. Oh, the waste chopper is actually not bad. Oh, there's another spinning of the wheels at the front. Um, yeah, I might put the automatic sensor on that, and it's good that you can customize that sort of thing. Got an old crate here that can go in there, and then a uh, a clock which I think was scrap metal or before, wasn't it? Yes, indeed. And I think that is literally it. So there we go. Thank you very much. Um, I think I am going to. I'm going to have a quick look. So for this thing, uh, sorry, it's in um, management, and I'm going to see what like some of the other skips you can have. Uh, there's just lighting and signage. We don't need any of that. Uh, what about the compactor? They have some metal stairs, which are pretty good. I don't think we need that. I do think with the scrap tires, 
automatic four door sensor. Um, upgrade, yes. So is that now active? It says it's active. And if we go over here, do we see any additional sensors? I don't know. Hmm. I'm guessing that the way it works as soon as you put it in there detects something and it, and it just works. Sadly, we will not find out with this massive uh, pile of recyclables here. And there's a lot of stuff in the back, so let's just get on to it. Oh, we're going to make so much money with this one. So, recyclables. We have recyclables. No, I don't. Recyclables. Um, we've got a garbage bag, which goes in the waste there. We've got the cabinet, which is in timber. I have a feeling that I'm going to have to start crushing stuff soon. There's a cabinet there. We can put that in timber as well. Yep, that's gone in. We have this uh, refrigerator, which is going to be household appliances. That's in there. And, oh, yeah, you can hear I've broke something. This bag is bulk trash. And we've got, what is that? It is another refrigerator. Let's just fling it to the back there. <laughs> And we've already made really good money. Um, a stove, once again, that's going to be in household appliances. Has this guy, like, basically renovated an entire property? <laughs> I was, or, like, um, is he just breaking into... Uh... Oh, I was going to say, I'll put that chair in there. I don't know if it was uh, correct. Is he just breaking into something and uh, instead of selling it, we're just his fence, essentially, just getting rid of it via crushing. Hmm, that is possible. So it looks like everything's sorted, so I'm going to charge a customer 16 units of currency. Uh, I thought we'd be paid more than that. Hmm. Anyway, we have made good money, and I think we're only perhaps one more job away from getting the garden shredder. Although, to be fair, since we've got this thing, we've hardly used it. We've used it about two or three times. Yeah, definitely the last couple of uh, couple of jobs we haven't. <clears throat> so, what do we need anything on here? Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to activate both of these crushes. And there you go. And so we've got some cleaning to do. And oh, once we've done this cleaning then, that means that we will be able to uh, afford that that new shredder. I, prob I probably won't get it straight away, I, um, only because there's a customer waiting. Um, I'm just going to... What was that noise? <laughs> I'm going to give this a clean and we'll see what the customer's got and then we'll we'll do that one and then we'll get the garden waste. Although we should probably do it beforehand, shouldn't we, maybe? Hmm. Because then the next one could be the, uh, the waste that we... Yeah, it could be the waste that we've got new. Excuse me. Tell you what I'll do. I'm going to try this automatic sensor. Is it going to work? Yes, it does. Excellent. Um, keyboard stand. That was metal, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm just going to double check though. Um, we'll, we'll do all of this recycling and then we'll buy the machine and then we'll send the van away. Let's bulk trash that thing. That table. A couple of boxes here. Hopefully they still have got the TVs in. <laughs> There'll be a distinctive crushing noise if they have. Another tyre. And good to see that it does turn off. And we don't recycle that. So I think that's it. Oh, of course, two tyres. I could have made a bit more money. Darn it. Anyway. And I also didn't unlock this before they went. Anyway, garden waste, yes. Shop. Go down. Garden waste chopper, yes. We're going to put that on near the scrap tyres and garden waste, and I sadly can't fix a light sensor on it just yet, but, ooh, right. That is a big bit of plant, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's big. There's all of the bits at the back there. Oh, we've got another car coming in, and I'm noticing some garbage bags. I think there was a sort of bottle or something in the back there, or maybe a plastic container, and garbage bags, so that goes in, oh, it doesn't go in recyclables, goes in garbage, uh, the gas bottle, the gas cylinder, we don't recycle, um, so that goes in there, that's a different type of tyre, there we go, and VHS, residential waste, <laughs> I'm not even going to ask what's on that. Uh, charge fees, and there we go. Check out. Oh, we've also got 500. So I'm going to go to management. 
chopper, automatic photo sensor, yes. The next thing I want, I think, is metal stairs for these. We don't need them, because all I do is just come here and drop it in, but it might just be better to to have. How do we turn this on, actually? Where's the, where's the on? Where's the on? Do I have to fuel it up first? Oh, another car straight away. And... <laughs> There appears to be a stove sticking out the back window there. I'm fairly confident that's um, that's a broken window. And <laughs> there's an oven, right. So that goes in this waste. We've got a cabinet, which is going to be timber. And that's it. Simple enough done. I definitely want to try the garden waste machine out. Oh, wait. Hmm. An achievement for activating the shred ore. But we're going to use the auto magic setting. Uh, 91 generic units of currency. Oh, another car's coming along. And we need 300 for the steps. Although, to be fair, we don't really need them. It, it's just more of an aesthetic thing. Um, yeah. I guess what would be nice eventually is to have like all of the LEDs on and things like that. But I don't think that's going to happen. And paper bag. I mean, that's just going to be in waste paper, surely. Yeah. Okay, well, one, two, three, four. I appreciate this guy's efforts to recycle absolutely everything, but I'm guessing the environmental impact and also cost of simply driving here with four paper bags in the back is worse <laughs> than just disposing of that in other, other ways. <laughs> By all means, put it in the car. Maybe, you know what, maybe they, were, maybe they were on the way back from work or something. They work in that building over there, and they live uh, down that road. And they were driving past anyway, and they just happened to... Maybe, you know what, they, may, they might have even picked it up off the side of the road. So I'm <laughs> being all judgy, and, you know, we never know. These narratives we do need. Um, right, I'm seeing... Oh, okay, so I'm seeing a tyre, a very big tyre, and I'm also seeing some garden waste as well. So the table will go in timber. We'll have this uh, cupboard go in timber as well. We want the garden waste, that's chopped trees here, uh, going in as well. I'll tell you what, I'll put the tyre in first. That's now done. And carpet is bulk trash. It actually looks like more of a log as well. And Oh, hang on, wait. The tyre jumped out. It's actually good that it does that. Anyway. So that goes in there and... Oh, that's ace. That's brilliant. Alright. And we charge fees. And that goes. I didn't check if we were to charge fees from the trees. Because if we go and charge anyway, we know we're going to get some from the tyre. And if there was chargeable fees for the chopped trees, it would do that as well. But um, we don't sort the other one as well. Excellent. So yeah, that was interesting. It does actually... It, it physically simulates uh, not only the bits coming out the bottom here, but also the tyre as well. That was, uh, that was a nice surprise. Oh, there's already a car. I'm going to have to... Uh, going to have to get to that. Yeah. Once we've cleaned this thing up. Can't say it's the best mini game on the planet but what it does do is rewards you quite well for with the satisfaction ratings which is as far as I can tell the biggest barrier to entry for buying new equipment okay one or two more cars I think I'm also noticing it's only one person driving rather than multiples you don't get oh there's bags again same thing this person has heard about the <laughs> the um, very heroic tales of the similar recycling savvy person and decided that they want to recycle four paper bags too. <laughs> I hope the suspension's all right after that because uh, could have could have could have been a bit of a problem there. Uh, we've got decent money. I think we can. Let's have a look. Look at maybe the waste chopper. Nothing really to go on there. The scrap tires. We can have a. We can have metal. Uh, metal stairs. All right. For these ones, we can have metal stairs. What about the 
other ones here, nothing in that one, nothing in that one, bulk, nothing in that one, and yeah, nothing. So basically we've got either stairs going up to the top there to look down on, or we've got, uh, that guy didn't even stop there, perfect. Um, yeah, we've got the stairs to go on the big tyre shredder, or we can do one of the others. Anyway, we're going to get this recycled here. We've got some nice things to go in, so that's fine. And obviously remembering the lots as well. Can that just fling in there? No, I can't. And I'm going to put it not only on the bottom, but also on the top. I can go in there. Refrigerator naturally is going to go in the back there. And the household appliances. A couple more beer crates here. I wonder if I can ping it off the side. Not really. Uh, more plastic boxes. And finally, a garbage bag to go in residential waste. And... Is he doing the like, Michael Jackson lean there? <laughs> anyway, we're going to say, do that. And yes, there you go. Satisfaction earned. 56 satisfaction, 583 generic units of currency. I think we'll do one more vehicle and call it there. Or hopefully it's going to be garden waste or the tyre shredder, just because those are pretty good. And I don't think I'm going to bother with the stairs on any of these other things. I think electrical devices would be good, because you do get a testing station, I think. Glass would be okay. The... Oh, yes. Extension for the second-hand shop allows to sell electronic devices. Yeah. Second-hand shop, 4,000 for that. Nowhere near, uh, don't have anywhere near the amount uh, for that. Oh, here we go, perfect. And this is going to be usage of both of our new to this episode machines. So we've got a folding screen, that's going to be scrap metal. We've got a, a cleaning trolley. Oh, I thought that would have been metal, but apparently wrong container. Satisfaction has gone down. That is a shame. All right, let's put that in there, and we're going to pick up some of this, uh, some of these trees and such, and <laughs> yes, it jumped out again. <laughs> the thing is, it classed as being done because it made that dinging noise. Yeah, that's getting chopped. All right, brilliant. Has that jumped out the thing again? It really has. That that tire does not want to be recycled. And last log here. And it goes. I love that. See all the stuff. Yes. And did the tire jump out again, or is it good? I think it might be okay. And uh, right, charge fees for the yeah for the tire. But sadly, we did get the clean trolley one. But uh, wrong. But no matter. That's uh. That is what it is. All right. Well, I think we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of my recycling center. Again, another like niche product that is very cathartic. Um, yeah, I'm happy with the two new things we've got. I mainly just wanted something that had some animation and actuation, and the fact that it's a big crusher is uh, fairly, fairly cool. It, it has just, just that one, just one more car thing. Uh, oh, go on. We'll have just one more car. Just one more car to round off this video and oh, to be honest it's nowhere near as interesting or as big as the last one but we are going to get uh, 60 units of currency for this one and there we go there we go not too bad at all so we're going to leave that for now that has been a bit of the game um, didn't expect a lot of people to review the first one don't expect the same for this one but hey um, probably will be surprised if you like the game and you want to see more by all means let me know in the comments and also if you do then what sort of machines would you like to see what sort of things unlocked as always we'll go from there thanks very much for watching take care and generic partings